through. What is this person saying? What if you're not sure if you're a man or a woman, and then you aren't sure if you're non-binary? Why is gender so confusing? It's not really, though, is it, though, is the thing. I spent most of my life feeling like I'm a man, but then I realized, what if I'm not a man? I just don't like being a woman, but then... And it's already indistinguishable from parody. Your guess is as good as mine. I realize I'm just experiencing intense dysphoria from people assigning me traits and roles based on my genitals, but then kind of wanted to come out as non-binary, but I kind of felt weird about it because I was like, I don't know if I actually care what people refer to me as. And plus, I know that people are going to assign me the role of woman. What? Like doctors? regardless of how I identify. Then I realized that gender just isn't an important aspect of my identity. And if people perceive me as woman, oh well, because like the title woman doesn't actually mean anything. Yeah, I, I think until, you know, Dylan Mulvaney can give birth, I think it still means something. And the popular understandings of gender are deeply intertwined with white supremacist and patriarchal ideas that I cannot escape alone and must help dismantle. Well, first off, I doubt you could dismantle an Ikea coffee table. Secondly, the common understanding of gender is actually deeply entwined with reality, which I think the vast majority of these people actually do understand. I think this is 99% about fashion. The story of how I went from constantly obsessing over and getting nauseated about perceptions of my physical form to only sometimes doing that. And the story of why it's wild watching other white gender non-conforming people refuse to participate in any effort towards liberation outside of making sure that they specifically are not perceived incorrectly. So that's just a giant word salad that doesn't mean anything. It's total gibberish. Um, and it's also an act, I believe. I don't think this can be serious. Nobody can actually believe this nonsense. Um, it's just a bunch of buzzwords thrown together in so, to make some kind of pseudo argument. It's not real. I mean, obviously, the whole gender thing is just a because I mean, let's not forget gender used to just be synonymous with gender used to just be synonymous with sex, right? You just interchangeable words. Then it was redefined into this metaphysical thing, this abstract idea that's separate from your physical sex, right? It's essentially the progressive soul at this point. It's this, it's been redefined as this abstract idea that can just be literally anything. I mean, they say there's an infinite number of genders. I think that's what the plus is for at the end of the, the you know, uh, Wi-Fi uh, password, all those letters. You know, it could, it could just be literally anything. It's it's not a real, it's a, it's an article of faith at this point. You just have to believe, right? Somebody says that they're omnigender, which means they're every gender, which is an infinite number of genders. You just have to believe. Of course, there's no evidence that this exists. It's just an idea, but they pretend that it's real. I don't see how that's really good for people, to be honest. Um, but let's take a look at the comments here. They're all just so exhausting. Yes, it is exhausting. It's exhausting if you try and understand what they're talking about. Let's go back to the end here. To only sometimes doing that. And the story of why it's wild watching other white gender non-conforming people refuse to participate in any effort towards liberation outside of making sure that they specifically are not perceived incorrectly. I spent... Sorry, Kami. You're in a cult. and You're not making any fucking sense. Just a bunch of buzzwords that don't actually mean any goddamn thing at all. It's not difficult at all. Woman equals born with a vagina. Man born with a penis. Yeah, that's a pretty good rule of thumb right there, isn't it? Let's see. Binary psychosis has nothing to do with gender. It's a construct created out of thin air to program you because that's how your mind works. Yeah, it's, it is all just a, it's, this is all metaphysics. You know, there's nothing real or concrete behind it. All right, so Jay Ham is saying, in the past, all news was controlled by the big three networks, but now we have channels like yours that have taken control away from them. Keep it up. You are the future. Well, thank you very much, sir. That's the sort of thing I like to hear.